वेलकम टू इंजीनियरिंग फंड ऑफ फैमिली दिस वीडियो इज अ पार्ट ऑफ नेटवर्क थियोरी लेक्चर सीरीज एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई बी गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू टू वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग एग्जाम्पल्स बेस्ड ऑन ग्राफ टर्मिनोलॉजीज आई हैव ऑलरेडी मेड वीडियो बेस्ड ऑन ग्राफ टर्मिनोलॉजीज इन विच आई हैव एक्सप्लेन यू वॉट इज ब्रांचेस वॉट इज नोड वॉट इज डिग्री ऑफ नोड वॉट इज ट्री वॉट इज को ट्री वॉट इज लिंक वॉट इज ट्विग सो हियर इन दिस वीडियो आई एक्सप्लेन यू how to identify all those graph terminologies by two examples so let us have first example over here so if you observe here we are given with one interesting graph and for this graph we are deal with to find number of trees and co trees and also we need to plot one tree and its co tree and i need to show you twigs and links for given graph so first question that is very essential in which we are deal with to find number of trees and co trees now whenever you see graph first of all you need to see whether this graph is complete graph or not so what is the meaning of complete graph complete graph means all the nodes are connected with each other so you see this node is connected with all the nodes you can observe this node is also connected with all the nodes so likewise all the nodes are connected with each other what it means this given graph is complete graph so for complete graph number of trees that is equals to n to the power n minus 2 and n is number of nodes in the graph so you can observe here 1 2 3 4 5 5 nodes are there so total number of trees that will be 5 to the power 5 minus 2 means 5 to the power 3 means it will be 125 so for given graph possible number of trees are 125 so number of trees that is equals to number of co trees right so here we are having total 125 trees so you can say there are also 125 co trees so for complete graph it is very easy to identify number of trees and number of co trees now my dear students i'll explain you how to plot one tree and of its co tree and i'll show you what is twigs and links for that tree and co tree so to plot tree and co tree first of all you should know in plotting of tree it should cover all the nodes so first of all i need to draw all the nodes here total five nodes are there so i am plotting all the nodes you observe to plot tree now here when you plot tree at that time it should cover all the nodes and there should not be any loop so you see with respect to node 2 now what i am doing is i am connecting all the nodes and it is not going to form loop so you can observe here this four branches that i have connected right and it is not forming any loop so this is my tree that i can say and when i represent tree at that time there will be branches that branches will be represented by twigs so you see over here this branch is f this branch is c this branch is d this branch is g so i can say here with this tree twigs are f c d and g so these are the twigs of this tree now my dear students i'll be going to explain you what is co tree for this given tree so again i need to redraw all the nodes now my dear students what is co tree so when you talk about co tree so that will be complementary of tree so this is tree right now so other than 
tree, whatever branches are there, that I need to plot. So you see, this branch is not present in tree. This branch is also not present in tree. You can observe, this branch is also not present in tree. This branch is also not present in tree. This branch is also not present in tree. And this branch is also not present in tree. So, if you combine both of this, tree and co3, then you will be having this complete graph. Right. So, complementary of tree, that is co3. So, I don't see any other branches which is not there in this tree over here. Right. So, what it means? This is my co3. Now, co3, that will be combination of branches which are links. So, I can say here links are all these branches. So, what are the names of these branches? So, you see this is J, this is I, this is H, this is E and this branch that is B and this branch that is A. So, all these branches are links. So, I can say here link is A, B, E, J and H. So, links of this co-tree that is what this branch and branches of tree those are represented by twigs. So, that is how we can have drawing of tree, co-tree, twigs and links. There are possible 125 trees with this given graph. I cannot explain you all 125 trees over here, but I have shown you an example. Let us have one more example. So, in next question, for the given graph shown below, consider the following set of branches. And those branches are A, B, E, C, E, F, A, B, D, A, B, F and A, E, F. The tree of the graphs are. So, here first of all we need to understand in this graph how many branches will be there with tree. So, number of branches with the tree will be n minus 1. So, you can observe here how many nodes are there? 4 nodes are there. So, I can say 4 minus 1 means 3 branches will be there with tree. So, out of this phi, any option is possible as all these phi options are having 3 branches. Now, let us check what are the trees. So, for identification of trees, you should understand only one thing. It should cover all the nodes and it should not form loop. So, you see A, B, E. So, A, B, E covers all the nodes and it is not forming loop. What it means? This is tree. C, E, F. So, C, E, F, it is not covering all the nodes, it is not covering node 1 as well as it is forming loop. So, this is not tree. A, B, D. So, A, B and D. So, A, B, D that is covering all the nodes and it is not forming loop means this is also tree. Now, A, B, F. A, B and F. So, it covers all the nodes and it is not forming loop means this is also tree. Now, A, E, F. So, A, E, F. So, you see it is covering all the nodes. But you see here it is forming close loop. What it means? This is not a tree. So, that is how we identify that 1, 3 and 4 are trees of this graph. So, 1, 3 and 4, this is correct option. So, whenever you have a question based on how many trees are there with given graph, then first thing that you should know is whether this graph is complete graph or not. For that you should know that for given graph, all the nodes are connected with each other or not. That In that case, you can say this is a complete graph. And then you can apply formula which is n to the power n minus 2, which are number of possibilities for complete graph. If it is not complete graph, 
then also we can identify how many trees are possible over here but for that we need to identify ar into ar transpose determinant right that even we are really to see in future videos but this is short way to identify and you should also know that how many branches are there with tree so that will be number of nodes minus one right so this is the basic thing which you should know when you solve problems based on graph terminologies i hope you have understood this still if any query is there just post that in comment box i'll be definitely try to help you out for sim thank you so much for watching this video